Roger in Sutton, Coldfield, England. Hmm. Last couple of days, we've had a lot of England questions. Anyway, Roger writes to me, my system sounds stunning. Stable, well-focused, and positioned imagery and bass that makes your teeth chatter. Ah, I love it. Bass that makes your teeth chatter. Nothing better than that, my friend. The thing is, my DAC is good. It cost several thousand a few years ago, but it doesn't support DSD. So could you explain if and how DSD would make an audible difference? I really value your advice and have installed acoustic panels, power regenerators, and positioned subs based on your excellent videos, all achieving noticeable improvements. Thank you, sir. Well, that's a tough one. The mere fact that a DAC handles DSD, I don't think is all that relevant. Unless you're trying to play DSD files, <laughs> then it's really relevant. Okay, so we make DACs that convert everything to DSD and then to analog, and that is one of the secrets to our DACs. But that same DAC, if you didn't have the ability to play DSD into it, if I'm understanding your question, wouldn't really matter. Unless, of course, you have DSD recordings. So I think if I were looking for a new DAC, and it sounds like you probably should be looking for a new DAC, I'm going to go with paying close attention to Sonics, trusting the brand, trying it out. I'm going to recommend our DACs. We make some of the best DACs in the world. They do DSD. They have DSD inside of them. We just launched a new one called Stellar Gold, and that DAC is stunning. That's an amazing DAC. Is it as good as the MK2? No, but it's pretty darn close, and I'll bet it'll blow the socks off of what you got. So, all right. Thanks for the question. Good luck.